All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another property home tour. If this is your first time tuning into this channel. My name is Chuck, it's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas. I'm a licensed real estate agent out here in Las Vegas, Nevada, bringing you another property home tour. So today I'm out here in the southwest of the Las Vegas Valley. And uh, we are in a master plan community of Mountain's Edge. And uh, we're gonna be touring this lovely home right here for a investor from out of state. We're doing a 1031 exchange and I uh, figure why not kill two birds with one stone? I'm gonna do a video and I'm also gonna send my clients this video. So a lot of times when I work with uh, investors that are doing 1031 exchange, you know, you definitely have to trust the real estate agent that you are working with. And um, one of the services that we do provide is video home tours and walking our clients through the process and the transaction and also disclosing what's going on with the home because we're basically the eyes and ears for our investors, right? So at the end of the day, it's not about trying to you know slam one client into a deal and that's it. It's about building that long-term relationship. Now with this investor, I've closed multiple deals in the past and now they are allocating more money into the Las Vegas housing market. So um, like I said, we're killing two birds with one stone. So the property's here in the southwest of the Las Vegas Valley. This is a gated community. Now the uh, total HOAs on this is $120 a quarter. Now this is gated. Now a couple things here that I see as we pull up through the gate, uh, the garage are in the back of the house. Then the front of the house is the front entry. And this one is a little bit uh, unique, right? It's different from the rest of the uh, communities. However, there's a couple things already that I just don't like about this one. Um, as you can see, we have a garage here. It's a two-car garage. However, it's only about five feet for the driveway. So when I look at investment properties, right, for clients, especially detached single family residents, the first thing I do is I take a look at the comps to see if the numbers make sense. If it does make sense, that is great. But also I wanna take a look at the physical of the home, okay? Can we rent this thing out? Yes, we could definitely rent it out. So that's one part of the equation. The second part of the equation is that on the resale value, okay, can I sell it for top dollar? So it's, think about it as this. You have the same amount of money. Would you rather buy a condo or a townhome? Would you rather rent a condo or a townhome, right? Would you rather buy a, a single family residence or a townhome, right? Then when you go to sell it, you have to think it in that way, right? Now, there are some homes that are more starter homes. So there's one negative that I don't like about this right here, especially at the price point that we are at. So this home right here, the asking price is 438,000, okay? The sellers are definitely motivated on this one. Uh, the score footage is 2,282, oh, it's 2,282 square feet, okay? The exterior looks to be uh, pretty good, well-maintained, a lot of vegetation, okay? Now, property features four bedrooms, three baths. So first thing, as we come in, we have the gray walls, feels a little bit dark, 18 by 18 tile, okay? Can we rent this out the way it is? Yes, we can definitely do that. One thing that we would probably have to do is definitely um, clean the tile. Now, for me, this is a little bit dark. You could probably get away with it. However, I would wanna paint this. And I've noticed that there's some blotch painting over here. There's some discoloration which means that there are two different brush strokes, two different paints here, I've noticed. Now let's come this way. Now, again, this is a very unique neighborhood. As you can see, the front door is here. So this is technically the front of your home, okay? Now on a resale, right, this would be a good rental, right? But this is not like one of those where if you sell it, you're always gonna get the top dollar for it because if you get a standard home where the front door and the garage is in the front door versus the garage in the back, and this is opposite like this, comparing that home to this home, you know, the home that has the front door and also the garage in the front, it's gonna go a long way. As far as resale standpoint. Okay, so those are a couple of variables that we look at. We take a look at location. 
Here we got the uh, dining room, pretty decent sized dining room. I mean, uh, baseboards are a little bit damaged here. Definitely could use uh, some paint, okay? Uh, the rental market, you can still rent out your property, but it has to be priced correctly. And now uh, tenants are looking at what they can get, but obviously location is a big part. Looks like we have a nice island here. You got granite, undermounted sink. Definitely needs a full detail on this one. Looks like they changed the uh, cabinets here. As you can see, there was no hand pulls, and the original tenant here just kept grabbing it. And now with your fingernails, you have these uh, scuff marks and the damage here. We have full package appliances. It says that uh, it's all included. Yeah, definitely need some uh, detail, little dings here and there. Here's your pantry. I mean, I would definitely get rid of this gray paint because it's too dark. Now, this has a side yard. You got extra storage here. I'm gonna make this video a little bit quick here. Thermostat here, as you can see, the walls are all different shades, so it definitely has to be painted. Uh, the doors here, again, paint touch up throughout the whole house. Just gonna come in, turn off the lights. Let's take a look at the two car garage. Two car garage steps down a little bit. A lot of oil stains. Uh, definitely needs to be acid washed and also epoxied. Here, oh, here's the hot water heater right here. All right, let's make our way upstairs. And I gotta get ready for bowling. Also, I wanna give a quick shout out to Lauren and John for closing on their massive home today. Here's the uh, prime primary. They waited for almost like a year and six months or so to finally get their home completed. I mean, they built a massive custom home. TV goes right here. Let's come into the uh, primary bath. This right here, you can just tell this is a, a American West home just by the products that they use. It's kind of crazy, you like, you do this for so long, you kind of already know the builders just by the material. I mean, all this is still in good condition though. Look how old school that light is right there. Yeah, with the rental market right now, you, you definitely have to have your property moving ready. Looks like the, you have the distribute sounds, attic access. Looks like they've been up there a couple times. Thermostat here, TV here. I don't know if you guys can see the different discoloration of the paint. Looks like they try to touch up the paint with the wrong paint color. Yes, it is a little bit dark here. You definitely need some blinds. Uh, for the price for an investment property, I'm gonna say for my clients, uh, this one is a no-go for me. I think uh, at this price point, I can find some better properties, more of a move-in, ready. Here, as you can see, down here, what happens is when you have a tenant in place, and this was probably rented by a tenant at one point, you have the shower rod here. Water comes here, drips here. People never notice that, and this is the dangerous thing. You always gotta check and watch these baseboards, especially here and on this side. This is an aqua tub here, or the brand. 
definitely missing a stopper that has to be replaced. We got some cracking right here above. Now the good news is that the seller is motivated. Now do you see the rust here? You see the rust here? Okay. My spidey senses, you see the rust here? And if you notice here, you got swelling because all the steam is coming up here. That means the exhaust fan is probably not working. Or not working good enough. Because look, all this is rusted. What's happening is there's so much hot steam that's coming out and just coming along here and just getting everything all rusted. That means it needs to be readjusted. That fan needs to be a lot closer or something. Here's the front of the house. It's cute, it has a little balcony. Oh, I'm gonna have to get going. It's bowling time. All right, so for my clients, it's a no-go. It's unfortunate. We have a drain pan here that that it's not original that was installed aftermarket i don't know let me know what your guys' thoughts are about this property also if you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe to the channel click that subscribe button i'm working very hard to earn your guys' business i mean look i don't have a life this is all i do i do it for you guys I really do. I want to help you guys. So if you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe, you guys can definitely show the love by hitting that subscribe button. You know what I'm talking about? Now the only way that this thing would make sense is the home price on this is a lot lower, where if I'm getting like a 12% return, I'm willing to take a hit on the resale side because it would be a cash flow deal, right? It would be a cash cow. And that's another thing. If you're planning on buying an investment property, we can help you out. I mean, I've bought multiple investment properties. I've flipped multiple investment properties as well. And if you're just getting started, I'll show you how to run the numbers. It's very simple. Well, it's not simple. I mean, definitely takes some time. All right, guys. Let me know what your thoughts are about this property. Again, if you're looking to relocate out here to Las Vegas, we can help you to do a 1031 exchange. Or we can help you sell your home in any state and to help you transition out here. All right, other than that, I wish you guys nothing but the best and be blessed, folks. If you guys want to check out all our video home tours, we have over 1,800 video home tours. Just go ahead and click on this video right here. If you guys are in the market and you want to purchase a home and want to get started, visit lvhomeexperts.com. Scan this QR code right now. Also, if you guys just love real estate and want to get into real estate, go ahead and subscribe to our second channel. Until next time. Peace.